China hacked Ministry of Defence in the United Kingdom. First of all, let's see what Sky News had to say a little bit about this. Sky News understands China has hacked the Ministry of Defence. The Chinese state is accused of two or three attempts at hacking MOD personnel. Sky's... The government will not name the country involved, but Sky News understands it to be China. The Chinese state is accused of two or three attempts to hack MOD employees, including personnel. The cyber attack was on a personnel payroll system with current service personnel and some veterans. It is largely names, bank details that have been exposed. The Defence Secretary Grant is expected to make a statement in the House of Commons today with the BBC reporting he will set out a multi-point plan which will include action to protect affected servicemen and women. Sir Ian Duncan Smith, a Conservative MP and former soldier who has been sanctioned by China, told Sky News, this is yet another example of why the UK government must admit that China poses a systematic threat to the UK and change to the integrated review to reflect that. Well, the good news is it was found. And this is China's government's two-faced policy. Now, there are hackers all around the world working for the government. The CIA would have hackers trying to get into Russian systems, into Chinese systems. And the Chinese and Russians would be trying to get into the UK, Germany and America, etc., etc. But China, got caught, caught with their pants down. Now, maybe this is because the technology in China, they say it's the best in the world, but let's be really honest, it's just propaganda when it isn't. There are some great products that do come from China, but not all of them are fantastic. So what do you think of this whole scenario or this cadaver? Please let me know in the comments below. Personally, I find this frustrating that, again, I repeat what I said earlier, China says, oh, let's have a global society. There is a global society already. China is not in it. China wants to create its own global society and be the dominant leader in it. For years and years, the dominant leader in the Western world has been America, and most people are fine with that. Even though we don't like Joe Biden, he is the leader of the free world. Xi Jinping wants to be dictator in China for life. He's got that already. And he wants to be the controlling party of the global society. But you can see he really is two-faced. At the moment, he's in Paris. He's meeting um, the French president. Then he's going off to the Pyrenees. And I think he's going to Serbia and somewhere else in Eastern Europe, again saying, hi, China is very friendly. But at the same time, they all got caught with their pants down by this revealing of this hacking attempt that on the Ministry of Defense. So well done for the people who caught the Chinese hackers. And you can see there are quite a few hackers that want, are wanted by the FBI and some security forces around the world. Of course, if you go to Chinese media like, I've forgotten now, Global Times, China Daily, they won't report this. This won't be in the headlines. I'm not even going to bother to go and check. And this is the system where they only report the bad things about America or the UK and the wonderful things about China, but never about any bad things. But they would report a flood which is happening in Jiangxi province, which is in the eastern side of China, looking like this. Now would be a time if I was a really good YouTuber and had a million followers 
I would have some advertising about how you can protect your own security on the internet by using Surfshark, which is like a VPN, a virtual private network, or some software that can help you and detect any malicious attacks. But I don't. So please help the channel grow by clicking the thumbs up, by subscribing. I would like to say hello to all the new subscribers. I think I got over 100 in the last 20 something days. So welcome to the channel. Thank you very much for your time for that. And of course, if you got a billion dollars lying around, not doing anything, hey, just drop in a couple of thousand to my Patreon account or to my super thanks or becoming a member of this channel. All the links in the description below. So, naughty China got caught with its pants down. One for the West, zero for China. Huh.